Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing well. In today's video, we are covering the topic Win32 Priority Separation. But before we get started, a quick little reminder. Win32 Priority Separation works differently now on Windows version 2042 compared to all the other versions. I need to look more into this, but as far as I know, you are now no longer able to reach long plus variable when you are on 2042. But for this video, I'll be demonstrating what it does for all other Windows versions. Now onto the video. Win32 Priority Separation is a Windows feature that lets you control the CPU usage for both foreground and background tasks. If that doesn't make sense, think about it this way. It helps adjust the CPU priority to either favor games that you are actively using or background processes. There are a lot of different values, so let's break down some of these terms that are used. The term fixed means for a constant time allocated to each process regardless of the priority. Every process will receive the same amount of CPU time before the scheduler switches to a different process. Variable. Variable refers to the time frames that change based on the process priority. Short and long quantums mean the amount of time the Windows scheduler allocates to each process or a thread. For the last term, foreground boost. This gives the process in the foreground extra time, but this depends on the value select. Now, this can be either up to two or three times the usual amount. The default value for this setting is two, but today we will be testing all the different possible values from 20 to 26 and from 36 to 42. Unfortunately, I have lost my benchmarks, but the two values that worked best for me were 16 hexadecimal coming in second place, and for first place was the value 2a hexadecimal. If you want to adjust these settings, you can follow me. Registry editor, each key local machine, system, current control set, control, priority control. Then double click, set this to hexadecimal, and input the value we would like to test. If you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and comment down below. If you would like to maximize the performance on your system, check out our free tweaking utility at sticktweaks.com.